wondering how can Ghana introduce two vaccines at once without any side problems. There are a lot of myths associated with vaccines. Because of the fear of the unknown. The coaching requirement really became more huge than we expected. In the meantime, people are dying. Pneumonia, diarrheal diseases have been one of the major reasons why children will die. So why not tackle the two major killers at once? The whole world is looking up to us. This is a dream come true. We did promise our children that we we're going to deliver two new verses at the same time. We said we we're going to do it. The whole world was watching. And we've done it. A successful lunch. The dignities are seated, the band is playing, the people are rushing in just because Ghana has made history. I therefore call on all to ensure that every child is fully immunized by their first baby. By introducing these two vaccines at once, Ghana is pioneering new territory in order to dramatically improve the health and survival of your nation's children. All the efforts to get these vaccines to our children it's come to fruition. I never thought I would see this day, and so I'm really excited that I can actually see the vaccine in our country. It is worth it. Every bit of time spent is worth it. I'm happy. The lunch is the beginning. Now, the vaccine has to reach every child in Ghana. Introducing a new vaccine is not just an event. It's a process. Now the plan is that the vaccines are being transported to the regions. Regions are also going to do their launching. And I believe from this session, Ghana can easily roll out on these two new vaccines. And therefore, by having those in the armamentarium of Ghana, what you've done is given them some of the strongest and best tools they can have to reduce their child mortality rates. They are training every health worker to have information about their new vaccine so as to be able to educate the public. So that education part is critical to what we do and having a cadre of educators that can speak in the local language can engage with the community is a really fabulous part of what we're trying to do here. Mothers are hearing, fathers are hearing, we know they will come in their numbers. I know that many mothers especially will be very excited because then they have healthier children needing less hospital admission. And here too, as we were here, the elder was talking about pneumonia and diarrhea and the fact that pneumonia kills children. By introducing this vaccine, the children can be healthy. And he said they want the children to grow up and be healthy adults like they are. Children are prized in our communities because we know that they are our future. This has been a huge success to save our, the lives of our children in this country. I think it's a good time to be a child in Ghana because we are going to combat two major diseases. This is something that other countries can learn from. I want to assure them that it is doable as we promised. It's a great achievement and we are prepared to do more. <laughs>